hi guys welcome back to my channel so today i have like a different look for you i usually have my hair like natural either naturally straight or mostly like curly doing those type of videos but you know from time to time i like to do my ponytail so i was like let me go ahead and make a video on how to do it and this is my results if you like them and you want to know how i got this ponytail and about maybe like 10 minutes at most just keep watching and yeah <laughs> you'll see i'm gonna get like straight into the video because i don't want it to be like super long because for some reason i don't know sometimes i feel like my videos are longer than they should be so if you watched my last video you probably should i used the dyson supersonic blow dryer and i blowed out my hair blew it out with um the comb attachment and you know usually when I blow dry my hair I'm gonna straighten it and I didn't really want to flat iron it so you know it's kind of just been like in a bun just chilling for a couple days so I'm like let me go ahead and do one of my like sleek ponytails and make a video on how I do it so this is what I usually do so I'll use um whatever product I'm using to slick it down like I'll put it like in my hands you know rub it around and then I just put it like right in the front. And you know, everybody, some people like the ponytails like right on the top of their head and some people like low ponytails. I like a high ponytail, but I don't want it to be like super high. Like, it's like, I don't know, you'll see. So I kind of just put that on and like already without even brushing. It kind of has like already like slicked my hair back. Okay, so I use a bristle brush, bristle brush, and I like brush it. And like this stuff gets like kind of hard. Oh, I've never used it for this, so oh, I didn't know it was gonna get that hard. Please excuse these faces I'm making. I kind of put it in like a loose ponytail. It's not really tight. And then I'll just like put this like around my hairline. Like not quite up here by the edges, but a little further back from it. And then I don't use that much in the back. I kind of just like rub it in and just put it on like that. Once you brush that through, you just kind of like smooth it out or whatever. So now that I slicked it back, you kind of have like this loose ponytail. And the only reason I do that is because I feel like if I kind of like mess up, I won't, it'll, it won't be as hard to like readjust it. So I like to slick it back like this and then I can like take out the ponytail I have and then put like the actual ponytail in. I think this is good enough. Oh, my arms are tired. Okay. So you just wrap it around. Like, you don't want it so tight that you feel like your face is like, <laughs> cause like you'll literally get a headache. Like I remember sometimes I make my ponytail so tight that like after like an hour of having it in, my head would hurt. Cause it's like, you know, this part is already tight and then you have the hair weighing down your hair too. So don't make it too tight where it's uncomfortable, but make it tight enough that it's nice and secure. So, like, honestly, I feel like this is good, but, you know, putting a little got to be won't hurt. But, see, I usually have to use this because my hair is like wet, but I'm just gonna put a little bit on like that. And then I just kind of like rub it in. Try to avoid getting this on the ponytail part. Your hair will be hard as a rock. And 
and then you can brush it in but i don't really need to just wanted to add it layer if i want to just like lay my edges and just not do too much i'll just use a regular toothbrush i feel like if i want to like swoop it and like make it all fancy i feel like i use this one or if i just want more control because i feel like this little comb adds a little more control so i'm just gonna lay my baby hair real quick they're a little over dramatic too but i don't know i just like them like this so another thing um you should make sure you do like once you're done with your edges like especially if you like pull out as much hair as i did like may i already did this off camera but just to show you like when you um pull it out it kind of like bunches up right here a little bit so just make sure you brush that out so it's still nice and smooth there's so many different types of ponytails you can get but this one has like this little lacing and then like the tracks are on each level and it has a comb right here and then this little velcro part so you like put the velcro around i want to show you up close so you can see you put the velcro around here and then like you know easier when it's on your head and then you just like wrap it around and then you use this piece to wrap it around and it gives it like you know that look that everyone does when they like wrap the piece around the hair it's not that thick though so you know if you want it to be like super thick you can always like grab some more and i've done that before but i think i'm just going to use this today like some people just leave their hair out because my hair is blonde at the tips like i don't want it to show so i just like kind of braid it up it kind of has that hump so hopefully it doesn't matter with my ponytail and i think that's another good thing with like where i place it like it's high but it's not too high so you just grab the comb make sure it's like sticking out and you put it like i put mine like kind of like in the bun some people put it like right here but that just i don't know for some reason it doesn't work like when i put it right above um the scrunchie so just put it like right above the bun right in the bun but like as close as the top as you can get it all right that's better okay so wrap this part around and grab the velcro part wrap that around Okay, whew. All right, so halfway down. So once the Velcro part is in, you can kind of relax your arms a little bit because it's a lot. So just make sure this is like brush out. And then you just like wrap it around. Grab a bobby pin. I put it like in the back so I don't want it to show. Just stick it in there. And you can adjust it if you need to. So I didn't add pieces. Alright. And just brush it out. And because this is like human hair, I can, you know, wash it as much as I want and, you know, use it over and over again. And it, it'll like bounce right back once I wash it and condition it. So yeah, this is it. It's crazy like what a ponytail does to your look. This is it, this is my final results. And yeah, I think it turned out pretty cute. Especially like what I came from, like 10 minutes ago, how my hair looks, so yeah. If you like this video, if you want me to do more videos like this, go ahead and comment below and let me know, like, 
and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.